It's Broadway and Bryant Park. Hey everyone, I'm Shoshana with VUA Show at one of my favorite free events of the season. This year, we are starting off strong with The Wiz, Back to the Future, Water for Elephants, Hell's Kitchen, and Amda with a free show, and The Goose, Tommy. You are not going to want to miss this amazing show. And you can come week after week. It's every Thursday. And if you miss it, don't worry, because you can watch the full coverage on BUA Show YouTube. That's B-W-A-Y-S-H-O. Thanks for watching. See you at the show. I'm so excited to be co-hosting today with Kyle Ramar Freeman. Woo! He is playing the lion in the Broadway production of The Wiz at the Marquee Theater. Just like today, it's been hot. My costume is very hot. But other than that, it's been a great time. Um, I love doing this show. It has a rich legacy. It's something that I thought I would never be a part of. So to get to be a part of it has been the most magical part. My cast is amazing. Um, and doing that show, spreading that joy and that love with black people is a beautiful experience. So I'm very grateful for it. And here's a little secret. Kyle's going to be doing double duty today. Not only will he be co-hosting, he's going to perform today as well. Yes, Woo! yes. And if you want to see Kyle on Broadway at the Marquee Theater, visit whizmusical.com for tickets and be sure to grab them quickly as there are only a few weeks left to catch the show, right? Yes, only a few weeks, six weeks left. All right, Kyle, our first performance is by the students of AMDA, College of Performing Arts, as a proud Yes, um, AMDA is uh, home. It was the first place to make me feel like home in New York City. I moved here when I was 18. Uh, it's the first place that I went to. It gave me a foundation. And I still use the facilities to this day because they allow me to come back and use it. So it's a beautiful place. I met a lot of lifelong friends there. And they really poured into me. So I'm happy that we are being celebrated today. And we have some kids up here who will do that as well. Yeah. I love it. So are you ready to get this show on the road? Yes, he's on down. I'm sorry. <laughs> for 60 years, and the College of the Performing Arts has been recognized through the, throughout the industry for its rich history and tradition of launching some of the most successful careers in theater, film, and television, and new media, with campuses in LA and NYC, and to provide unparalleled education and training for the aspiring actor, dancer, singer, versatile artists, and beyond. Me and Helen are thrilled to present a special pre-show performance celebrating AMDA's 60th anniversary. Wow. Featuring some of AMDA's brightest graduates, please join us in welcoming an AMDA graduate, faculty member, and Broadway star, Kyle Taylor Parker. Woo! Who will perform I Feel Pretty from his solo album, Broadway Soul, Volume 1.
future in the performing arts and for a chance to win tickets to some of today's hottest shows on Broadway. And of course, that had to make you proud. What must it be like, you're a recent grad at Amda and you come out and you do this stage with this crowd. What's that do for someone? Um, it encourages you to keep going, especially to be around all these other current Broadway shows. Um, sometimes a dream feels really far away, but if you're next to the people who are doing the thing that you want to do, it feels that much closer. Yeah. Wonderful. I'm, 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 that just feels like so electric and so, so fun to watch as well. You know, Broadway and of course Broadway and Bryant Park and also we've got some great partners that are supporting us as well, like Chase Freedom. You know, they're taking us behind the curtain. Did you know that only four of 41 Broadway theaters are actually located on Broadway? Do you know what they are? I'll tell you. The Winter Garden Theater, the Broadway Theater, the Marquee Theater, and the Palace Theater. The rest avenues and streets that make up New York's theater district. And that's the peek behind the curtain by Chase Freedom. I think it's time for the show. What do you think? I think so. I think so. The epic pop culture music theater sensation, The Who's Tommy. It is so good. I saw this one on Broadway as well. It's playing through July 21st, and it's exciting. describes it as thunderous and thoroughly intoxicating. While Entertainment Weekly insists, see it, feel it, it's electrifying. Let's hear it for the cast of the Who's Tommy!
You might have seen me singing my favorite Broadway tunes over here all afternoon, and I'm sure your voice is feeling a little <coughs> hoarse. Don't worry, our friends at Lee Cola are here. They got you covered. You can stop by their booth and grab a sample of their throat bone drops and say goodbye to everyday throat irritation. I use them all the time. It works. Check them out, okay? Yes, you guys know the theme song? We're going to do it on three. One, two, three. We Yes, after losing what matters most, a young man jumps a moving train, unsure of where the world will take him, and finds a new home with the extraordinary crew of a traveling circus and a life and love beyond his wildest dreams. So step right up and welcome Ken Wolf Clark of Water for Elephants. Woo!
the show. I am so truly excited for this next cast, of course, since Kyle is my co-host. After sold out ones in 13 cities across North America, the Wiz landed back on Broadway. This past spring, after 50 years, they came back. The outstanding company is showing off their belts, riffs, and whistle tones eight times a week at the Marquee Theater through August 18th before heading on the second leg of their national tour in February of 2025, so you gotta see it before it goes. I'm so proud to present Michelle Lewis, Melody Abex, Kyle Ramar Freeman, Avery Wilson, Palango Jones Jr., and the cast of The Wiz!
And if I happen to come around
so good. Melody Betts, everybody. Melody A. Betts. Sylvester and six-time Grammy Award-winning Glenn Ballard. 
with additional songs from the film including The Power of Love and Johnny B. Good. Ladies, welcome the cast of Back to the Future, the musical. Oh, boy. Put your mind 
Production introduces Ellen, a 17-year-old girl full of fire, searching for freedom, passion, and her place in the world. How she finds them is in a New York City coming-of-age story you've never felt before. Hell's Kitchen. It's a new musical from 16-time Grammy Award winner Alicia Keys, whose songs and experiences growing up in New York inspire a story that is made for Broadway. Oh yes, set to the rhythm of the 90s. We love the 90s, right? The 90s is good. Yeah. Hell's Kitchen is a love story between a mother and a daughter. It's about finding yourself, your purpose, and the community that lives you. I can relate to that. Yes, I'm sure. So come remember where dreams began. And well, welcome the cast of Hell's Kitchen to perform songs from the show available on the original Broadway cast recording on all streaming and digital platforms right now. Please help me welcome Gianni, Gianna Harris, Jay Milan, and Jackie Leon performing You Don't Know My Name. Oh, forever? And you never introduced yourself? Yeah, yo, he don't even know you're alive. He will. Go ahead then. Make your move. Shoot your shot. Ain't got so much game, prove it. Walk one up to him and be like...
Next, our last performance is by Donna Vivino performing Pawn It All from the new musical Hell's Kitchen. Broadway, MJHS Health Systems, and Health Kitchen on Broadway.